Eviction of illegal settlement from the reserve forest and protected forest by the government of Manipur continues to remain one of the contentious causes for the ongoing unrest in the state. However, Chief Minister N. B. Rain Singh on Saturday said the evictions were carried out throughout the state and it was never targeted towards any particular community. Well, taking to social media, Chief Minister N. B. Rain Singh said, from 1987 to 2021, Manipur has lost over 877 square kilometers of forest cover to poppy cultivation. He added, ever since the BJP government came to power, 291 encroachers have been evicted in Manipur. The chief minister said the evictions were carried out to protect the land from illegal exploitation and not targeted against any community. I am against the deforestation, poppy planters, corruption, drug smuggler. Our forests, once steaming with life, are now under threat. Degradation caused by various factors have left scars on our landscape, threatening the very balance of nature. Clear felling, poppy cultivation, encroachments and hill earth extractions have ravaged our forests, leaving behind desolate landscape and diminishing biodiversity. Unregulated establishment of villages within reserve and protected forest areas further exacerbates the problem, leading to habitat loss and fragmentation. But hope is not lost. The government of Manipur has taken decisive actions to combat this crisis. A joint survey of forests and revenue lands of overseen by a committee headed by the Chief Secretary aims to consolidate reserve and protected forest. With determination and resolve, authorities have launched crackdown on illegal forest encroachers. Armed with the law and a commitment to conservation, eviction notices are served signaling the end of illegal occupations. Encroachers are being evicted and the Forest Rights Act 2006 is being implemented to ensure the rights of forest-dependent communities. As bulldozers cleared away, reclaiming what rightfully belongs to nature, a message against the illegal exploitation echoes through the forest. Under the Chief Minister's Green Manipur mission, catchment areas like the Kaubru Ranch, Tangzing Ranch and various other places are undergoing rejuvenation. However, these efforts face fear resistance from those who seek to exploit our forests for their own gain. Forests are like die, no more reserve forests. Protest rallies and act of vandalism such as the burning of forest offices and vehicles poses a serious threat to both the property and personnel conducting the duty to conserve the forest. As the battle to save our forests intensifies, the need for collective actions and cooperations becomes even more urgent. Together, the people of Manipur must save the forests and the land from the illegal encroachers and the illegal immigrants destructing the forests and the land for their own benefits. <laughs>